Arsenal fan TV. Uh, you've got a smile on your face again today. Yeah. I mean, it was a very good performance by Arsenal today. Superb performance. Absolutely superb. I'm more than happy. I'm really happy with the team selection from Arsenal. Giving massive credit for that. Mm. Years gone by, Arsenal's gone into these games, seen them as dead rubbers and gone, yeah, we'll go and put a weakened side out and get battered. Do you remember the Olympiacos games that mm. we've had before on match day six, where we got spanked? Mm. Um, he worried about our job first. And that's what I was crying out for. I said. Mm. And to be fair, you did sort of call it before we were talking about it before the game. I was like, hey, no way Luda Goretz could uh, do anything. And you did say, you said, yeah. listen, they can do something. You never know. We got to do our thing. What was the, the, the thing you said earlier? You said, um, we need to do our business yeah, first. Worry about our business. Worry yeah. about our business because have no regrets. That's because, it, that was it, yeah. you know, if we would have lost this today and then we look at the result of PSG and Ludogorets, we'd have been kicking ourselves mm. more than anything. You know, we done our job. If we would have won this game and PSG won their game, we could go, do you know what? We're unbeaten and they've only gone ahead of us on a, on a head to head. Mm. What more can we do? You know, and... Everyone knows my views on Arsene, but I'm not going to beat him over pointless things like that. He's done. You're praising him tonight. I'm praising him massively. He's mm. done everything he can do. We've cried out for consistency and better performances in the Champions League, and we've got it. Yes, we didn't play well home and away against PSG, but we didn't lose. Mm. You know, and we've played six games. We've won four, drawn two. What more can we ask for as fans? Mm. We and Lucas, Lucas Paris tonight, hat trick for him. Yep. I mean, he's arrived now, hasn't he? Tonight, this is him. It's, he's arrived. Yeah, it's it's a big, big stepping stone for him. This could be the making of Lucas Perez. Mm. You know, he's not going to take Alexis's place up front right now, and we know that. Um, mm. But he's given Arsenal a few selection headaches for the for the flank because remember Perez played on the flank tonight mm. um, and what I liked about him was that his first couple of goals were what we would say were tappings they were quite easy mm. but he was in the right place it was like a fox in a box he knew where to be and from people that know the Spanish league and know Lucas Perez say that's one of his qualities he's a fox in a box so mm. It, the whole team, I thought Kieran Gibbs was excellent tonight. He was. And he's another one that's going to give Arsene selection headaches. And it's brilliant to have this. Um, Granite Shaka again, the guy. He just pulls the strings in the middle. And this is why we were getting so mad for him not playing. Mm. Because this is what he can do. Mm. And I think that us winning this group, it's all about a mentality thing. Now, I know we can get Bayern Munich and I know we could get Real Madrid. Who do you want in the next round? I don't care. I don't care because if you're going to win the Champions League and you're going to go far, you've got to play the best. And the year we got to the final, we played Real Madrid, Juventus, Villarreal, then Barcelona. You've got to do it. You know, you're not going to have an easy run all the way through. Mm. So let's just have it. We'll take anyone on. Let's go. Because we, what, what have we got to fear? If we play like we are playing at certain times, then we can be a match for anybody, Robbie. And this is all I get so frustrated about because I know it's there. It's getting it out of them on a consistent basis. And I know they won't do it every week, but you know, like I said, it's a mentality thing. If we get Bayern Munich, Real Madrid, no Arsenal fan is going to turn around and go, oh, Arsenal, you're this, you're that, because we won the group, look what's happened. No. If we finish second and we draw one of the big boys, then everyone's got an excuse to batter Arsenal with. And I know people, when I've said this to you, will say, you'll be the first one to do it. That's neither here nor there, but at the end of the day, We've done what we have to do. Arsene's done what he's had to do. And I'm really happy. Although, I must say, I'm fucking freezing. <laughs>